Hi everyone, welcome to the second part of the tutorial image upload using react native and firebase and yes we are also doing the cropping part so it will be image uploading and cropping using react native and firebase so in the first part what we will what we did was that we uh, integrated firebase to our project and we uh, initialized it you can see the code for initializing it so this all this stuff we did in the first part and in this part we will add one more package that is needed for uploading image and cropping it so that is react native image crop picker and uh, we will do it now so let's start so let's first install the package and it's npm install react native image crop picker I will use the version 0 0.1 yeah it's 12.4 so it's 0 0.12.4 and this will save the package to our project and you can just check the first part of the project if you are if you have directly landed on this video and make sure you subscribe to the channel to stay updated with the other parts that we will do so our uh, image crop picker and cropper is uploaded sorry is uh, installed and now we will we have to link it so we will do the linking react native image Crop picker. So React Native link, React Native image crop picker. This will link the package to our project. And once it's linked, then we have to do some more stuff using Xcode. So we have to open this project in Xcode and then we will do the remaining part so while my Xcode is opening uh, I would just like to tell you that please do subscribe and if you like our videos please do give it a thumbs up this will be very encouraging for us to do more such videos okay so now we are in Xcode and now what we will do is that we will first build our project and see what happens because many times when you install a new uh, package or a library to your project it might give some build errors so it's a good idea to uh, build and check if things are working or not every time you install a new library or package in case there is any error then we have to do some work around in most of the react native version things should work fine but in some older versions we have to make some adjustment ok so build failed and it's giving rct bridge module dot h file not found ok so that's not an issue we will fix that so first thing we have to do is uh, that we have to go to embedded binaries 
and we have to add two frameworks that is rsk image cropper framework ios.js sorry ios and one more pack uh, framework that is qb image picker framework so once you install and link your uh, image cropper package then you uh, this comes with that package these two frameworks and after building your project you will get this two framework so we just just need to link it but this need to be linked manually because the link that we performed uh, here that's not linking these two uh, frameworks because this is not the main frameworks Th these are embedded frameworks so we need to link it manually so after you have linked these two frameworks manually uh, we need to make uh, you can just go and try to build your project but uh, we have seen one error was there if you get this error that is rct bridge module h file not found then you have to make one adjustment that is you have to go to libraries and you have to go to image crop picker dot xcode proj and you need to go to build settings and then you need to type search paths okay you just have to type search and it will come so we need to locate this header search path and here you need to make some adjustment that is we need to make this example node modules to double dots and this is the correct path and again here we have to make the same change we have to make this example node modules to two dots and now both are correctly pointed so now we just need to build our uh, project and it should work this will be working fine in, uh, in most of the react native version out of the box but in some version you might have to make this adjustment so you just have to look out for this error that we got that rct uh, this rct bridge mod bridge module dot h file not found okay so build succeeded so everything is working fine now and we can we have to build a uh, we have to run the project through command line as well because the build that we did in Xcode won't be recognized by uh, react native so we have to do this here as well we run the project using react native run iOS and if you want to use any specific simulator then you can just give this option that is simulator iPhone 4s that I have given so if this works fine then I we have added the image cropper package successfully so let's keep our finger crossed and in the and i think if this works then this will be what we have done 
uh, I've, I, will, I have shown you in this tutorial and in next tutorial one more package we need to upload uh, we need to install and then we need to do a bit of coding and then uh, we, uh, you will be able to see how the image upload feature work it's not at all difficult if you know the steps correctly but uh, most of the developers get stuck with the steps because every environment needs a bit of tweaking and that is where uh, the developers get stuck I also uh, whenever I am working with a new version or there is some change I also have to spend a lot of time to make changes or to dig into things but that's fine that's part and parcel of the development world So build succeeded. So now it's installing the rnf.app file. And once it's installed, then we are done. Okay, our app is. running yeah so the second package that is image crop picker has been successfully installed so we have uh, in first part we installed firebase in second part we installed image crop picker and in third part we will add few more package or I think we are only left with one more package and then we will start the coding part and we are done and I'm sure this uh, step by step tutorial that we are doing will be clear to every every viewer who will watch this and please give a thumbs up so that it encourages us and please do subscribe to the channel thank you